So now for the Collaboration Awards. Collaboration takes exceptional leadership, teamwork, and communication skills. It also requires a level of compassion. These three students have demonstrated qualities deserving of a Presidential Award for Collaboration. As I call your name, if you can make your name to the stage, please, while I read some nice things. We'll start with Erin Wamsley, who was nominated by Ruby Gray, Assistant Professor in Nursing. Erin <laughs> is an in integral part of his graduating ADN class in the School of Nursing. He is leading the charge to reinvigorate the chapter of the Student Nurses Association. He serves as a linkage to care coordinator at Quidditch Health, supervising a linkage to care team in their efforts to rapidly connect people living with HIV to care services in our area. He volunteers at the American Legion to assist veterans, works with the local syringe service program, and is a local pride coordinator. Congratulations. <laughs> A student veteran for, who was nominated by Brian Cottle, Brian Rose exemplifies what it means to be collaborative. As current president of our Student Veterans of America, the SBA chapter, he is at the forefront of engaging with our veterans and military connected students. He takes part in conferences to showcase Shawnee State University, as well as collaborates with other SBA chapters to highlight best practices across the state and region, ensuring our students are receiving information and benefits. Luke is a vital asset to SSU. <laughs> and finally, our last student could not be with us today, but it is Alexis Brink. Alexis was nominated by Charles Kemp in teacher education. Alexis used elementary methods and experience to coordinate with a high school and an elementary school by developing a joint art project. The collaboration between high school and elementary students fosters relationships, inspiration for the younger students, and bridges the gap between two schools and two age groups. The work will be displayed in the upcoming Community Art Cultural Fest. The high schoolers still talk about the funny things the elementary students did and how they enjoyed the experience. So if we can give Alexis a round of applause. 